y'all, I know what you're thinking. What the fuck is up with my hair? Well, I had homecoming last night and I decided to do something with it. And by I decided to, I mean my ride offered to curl my hair and I was like, you know what, sure, you do you fam. You wanna curl this hair? Curl it, you're driving me to this thing. I'm gonna humor you. Does it look weird with the hat? Cause I feel like it kinda looks weird with the hat, but I have to wear that. It's my thing. That's what I do. I wear snapbacks in my videos. Without this, I'm nothing. <laughs> we are going to ignore the weirdness of the hair and move on with the video. Today I'm talking about, yes I know, very original, homecoming and why it kind of sucks. Now, don't get me wrong, I am always a fan for organized events that force people to hang out with me. But honestly, overall, homecoming kind of blows. It's not really the dances that I have a problem with. It's the music they play at the dances. Which is normally like, you know, stuff you grind to, to work to, I don't know, all those complicated hip dance moves that I just can't master. What can I say? I'm always one for the classics. Waltzes, salsas, lame things from the 50s. I can do this. I can do this all day long, motherfucker. That's right. Okay, but seriously, like, no offense. I'm not about that grinding, twerking lifestyle. I'm just not. I'm always a slut for slow dances and that kind of shit, but I'm sorry, I can't grind. I can't grind. It is not in my nature. If it is in your nature, if you like to grind, I'm not dissing on you in any way. You know what? You do you. It's your life. That's just not me. Well, so, due to the loud, throbbing dance music and both me and my dates, you know, anti-dancing nature, we spent most of our homecoming sitting in a corner, talking, and doing other shit. Okay, you know what, we kept it holy. For the most part, I mean, God wasn't crying, he wasn't smiling, he was just kinda like, hmm, yeah. Although, one thing I will say, there was not room for Jesus. Nope, sir. Although we did get to slow dance once, to the one slow dance song they played the entire evening. So that was nice, you know. You know, it's not even just the music, it was just, you know, the general ambiance. Now, you know what, shout out to my homecoming committee, because they did good with what they had, which was very, very little funding. But still, it was basically fairy lights and blue fabric on the dance floor, and just trees with lights on them outside, and the lights weren't even on outside, There's, it's just a dark courtyard. Not saying it wasn't a nice dark courtyard, of course. It was a lovely dark courtyard for most of the evening. And then they actually got the lights working, and it was an even lovelier, slightly less dark courtyard. So, you know, good work, guys. You tried. You tried so hard. Also, I feel like I should mention that at my homecoming, the last 30 minutes is a mess. I mean, everyone is so so hyped and turned, and I don't know what happens, but the dance floor is just a danger zone of groping and drunk people, and it's just scary. Like, if I had to give the freshmen one piece of advice for homecoming, it wouldn't be, wouldn't be about their dresses or their makeup. It would be, go home, go home after there's only 30 minutes left, because after that, it's just hell on earth. Literally just hell on earth. Okay, but in all seriousness, I had an amazing homecoming. I wouldn't trade that evening for anything in the world. It was perfect, but honestly, that had nothing to do with homecoming. That was the date. The date was great. Homecoming? Eh. Yeah, well, that was my homecoming, and yep, yeah, I hope y'all had a great time in your homecoming, or if you didn't decide to go, then I hope you had a great time doing whatever the hell you were doing. And if you're, you no, know, no longer in high school, congrats on that, you survived, I'm happy for you. Um, so yeah, if you like this video, give me a big thumbs up, if you want to see more of me, hit subscribe, thank you so much for watching, we survived this entire thing with the weird hair, so yay, uh, anyways, bye! 
Okay, and you know what? I just want to take a moment to appreciate the fact that I had a date to homecoming. You know what? That's right. I had a date. I know how to woo people. It's funny, because if I had talked like that, I definitely wouldn't have gotten the date. So, you know, it's a good thing I keep all that on the internet. <laughs> You know, I would love to give y'all all the details, but I just don't want to. You know, not that I'm not a huge fan of just giving a shit ton of personal information out on the internet. I'm just... Yeah, no, I don't want to. I don't trust y'all. Sorry. Sorry about it. <laughs> yep, okay. That's good. Uh, you can leave now.